What is going on guys? Welcome back to another show 18 Diamond Dynasty video and today yes you see on your screen we have the Seattle Manners team epic J Buner the bone 86 overall 1995 postseason card you get him at 90% of the Seattle Manners epic program. Here is his stats if you do not know already he's an 86 overall right fielder from the postseason 1995 66 contact versus righties, 62 versus lefties, 103 power versus righties, 90 power versus lefties, 54 vision isn't too bad. Uh, decent discipline, that doesn't really matter. Uh, 77 fielding isn't bad. 95 arm is really nice. 82 accuracy, 63 reaction, and 43 speed. Overall, a really nice card, and I can't wait to use him. He's really good, fitting the meta of the game right now. It's all power. And he's a good, like, he should be a good fielder. Of course, we know the fielding issues will still happen. Uh, for now, that is uh, hopefully they get fixed. Or, you know, in some some somewhat future. But great arm, great power. I cannot wait to use him. He will be in right field for me. This is going to be the squad. We do also have uh, Saber Hagen, Tori, and uh, eventually we'll get Williams and Sutton. And Morris to all debut as well. As you can see Saber Hagen right here, we do have. But the team right now is going to be Felix Hernandez. We're having him not in the rotation because uh, I don't want to pull him accidentally because I don't want to do two debuts in one video. It's kind of bad. Uh, Felix Hernandez, 80, uh, 85 Cole Hamels, Pineda, we got Casimir, Archer, and there it is. We have Gallo in our lineup, Hanley Ramirez, Larry Doby, Jay Buhner will be batting fourth, Robson Cano, Edgar Martinez, Jose, I mean Jorge Posada, and Alex Gordon on our bench will have Nelson Cruz, Jim Edmonds, Michael Conforto, who is up on the day against righties, Kyle Seager, another swimming swing, not bad against lefties, and up on the day versus righties. And we got Orlando Cepeda, because I am getting close, getting uh, farther ahead in Conquest Extreme. Almost, not almost, but I just have to conquer the Red Sox, and then I'll be on the final part of Conquest Extreme, which is going to take a while, but getting on the long stretch. Towards the end, we have Lee Smith in her bullpen, Pat Nechek, Mike Dunn, Drew Storen, Fernando Rodney, Brad Hand, and 80 Tom Williams in the breakout card from the Mariners Epic. All right, for, without further ado, let's get right into the game. We are a 504 rating, and we have a 10-1 record, 324 batting average, 193 ERA. Hoping our success can continue, and let's get into the game. All right, here we go. We're facing the North. Carolina Tar Heels, uh, Hayden underscore one underscore ball. We have Scott Kazer on the Danny Duffy. Uh, he has D. Gordon, Nar Solo, you know, Nelson Cruz, Ryan Zimmerman, no, Mike Moustakis, Robson Cano, rookie Yanni Molina, and Andrew McCutcheon. And there's our team on the right. Not a terrible team on the left. Haven't faced Danny Duffy yet this year. is uh, not terrible. Uh, we have a lefty for Buner. I believe he does hit righties better. 103 powers and lefties. I mean, righties. Not terrible versus lefties, of course. But, hoping uh, we can do some good with him. This guy, I could see from D. Gordon and Marcelo Zuna. He's hitting 220 with around 220 with both of them. He's one at the first pitch and it's one in an outside changeup right there. Didn't really actually swing at it. He checks one, but he tried this swing at it, which is all that matters. And he swung at that too. So, I am not sure about this game. <laughs> I have good. I have good feel. I get hope. I have hope for it though. If I slur my words every second, I have hope for it though. Hopefully, we can take advantage of this and get a home run with Buner. That'd be that'd be ideal. All right, nice and easy. One, two, three inning for Scott Casimir. Let's get the bats on. I, I just forgot what I was gonna say. I, whatever. <laughs> There we go, Hanley. That's our first hit of the game. An oppo. Uh, kind of a jammed hit. So hopefully, we get on base with Doby. So we can get Buner up. He is up next. I would, I, it'd be ideal for a three run home run. Okay. That was a terrible pitch. I don't know why I swung at that. Don't ask me why. Uh, actually, you can't ask me why. I'm a moron. <laughs> Here is Jay Buner, though. First at bat on the squad. Gonna look for a pitch to drive. I have not used a silver card yet, and I've heard a lot of good things about it. And G Buter, the bone, goes deep in his first at bat on the squad. That is deep on his second pitch of oh, squared up. 
absolutely destroyed by the bone and we are winning two to nothing and he has a 1000 batting average thank you that is not good Dobie couldn't get there and that's a triple that's a leadoff triple that that is that is not good Change up got a little too much plate. A little too much plate, Mr. Casimir. Alright, we're gonna give up a run on the ground ball. I don't mind. Yo, get him, Gordon. Get him, you're gunned down. I don't know what you are thinking. Edgar Martinez on the first pitch of the inning goes deep to left field and that is going to go into the stands. One foot off of a 420 foot home run. That's unfortunate. Hey, but it's a 419 foot home run because that is the day this is going to be up. So, there you go. Alright, here we go. Jay Buhner up again. The bone. He had a two-run home run in his first at bat. A fastball over the plate. Well, not over the plate. Above the zone. Looking to do some more damage here. And he is two for two with a single and a home run. I think if I just I was above that, but if I was below that, that might have been his second home run in the game. I want to see that. Yeah, that might have been my, if I PCI was in a different area, that might have been the second home run of the game. As Robinson Cano just goes oppo, taco, don't you know, for a two-run home run. And we're up 5-1 to one just like that on a er curveball inside just early. On a curveball. And that goes oppo. We're winning 5-1. to one. This is a hell of a debut for Mr. Jay Buhner. And he sends me a friendly quit. We don't roll that way, buddy. We don't roll that way, bro. And he quits. Unfortunate. Unfortunate. That is actually really unfortunate because... I needed a thumbnail from that game. <laughs> I needed a thumbnail of Buner with the no down animation. Well, shit. <laughs> but I think that may be it for this video. Unfortunately, I don't have time for another game. We're gonna probably have to get to the home, uh, the the uh, thumbnail in a CPU game, which will unfortunately tarnish his uh, stats just a little bit. You know, just one game, hopefully just one at bat and one more home run. Wouldn't be terrible, but he went two for two in his debut with a no doubter and a two RB, two RBIs and a single. Absolutely a great, great debut. That was against a lefty too, the one he's worse against. I'm telling you, power is key. And, yeah, I really, I mean, if out of all the epics, I will probably continue using this card. And I know uh, Cubs fan 4 was curious if I was doing a review on it. I, I mean, if I use it enough, get enough gameplay, I would definitely not mind doing a review. Because, you know, Team Epics, you grind out Team, uh, team Epics this year. And you, like, you can still do it for last year, too, because it's a collection. You could still do a review on it if it's worth it or anything. Basically, I'll do that eventually down the line maybe in like a week or two it's worth it uh but really in my opinion one of the one of the most epics that you should probably go for is like chris davis uh right the david price uh you know if you want omar scale uh victor martinez definitely uh there's riano if you want a pitcher but like this specifically batters definitely jay buner is a really really nice one his swing is beautiful you know, there's a lot of good other good, other good cards in here too. But that is going to do it for this video, guys. If you guys did enjoy, want to see more gameplay down below, let me know if you want to see the Brett Saberhagen debut or the Joe Torre debut in the next one. I'll do, I'll be doing both. 
But if you guys want to see anyone specifically sooner, uh, let me know down below. Hit that like button if you did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. Roll the 4K. And I'll see you all in the next one. Have a great rest of your day. I like me better when I'm with you.